Hey Mama is proudly brought to you by Omo Ultimates. Tackles 99 tough stains in one product. Being a mum is a miracle for some and a huge blessing for me. It's so hectic. It's constant. I have this day planner that just goes on for years. You just never know if you're doing it right, if you're doing it well enough, if your kids are well adjusted. You want so badly to be able to, to be the best mum ever. You're normal, 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 then you're yeah. like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think one thing that our mums didn't have that we have to contend with is technology. Mm -hmm. With the iPads and iPods. I think just the access to all the screens is mm. really difficult to police. And having to have them for school these days. Yeah, but everyone yeah. has a device. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. Even to homework being on the computer oh, yeah. via mm -hmm. a website that they get a, yeah. a school user ID for. Yeah. Yeah. They never actually know what they're doing on their computer. Mm -hmm. They tell you they're doing homework. When they were little there wasn't so much iPad, iPods around, but now there seems like that's all they want to do. It does annoy me, but I just think it's not going away, but I don't really know what to do about it either. Sometimes I just have visions of myself with a big sledgehammer going around and just smashing every single electronic device in their house. It's just got worse, you know, and yeah. you have guidelines and rules and stuff and they just mm -hmm. push them constantly. All the time. Mm -hmm. For yeah. me, it's really crapped yeah. up on me. Yeah. And just the last holidays, I just got jack of it. They were just always on their iPads. Mm -hmm. and, and actually, I checked their history, mm -hmm. what they're looking at. They're only 10 and 12. Mm -hmm. you don't even, I don't even want to say it out loud because mm -hmm. I'd be embarrassed. Aww. And like, I am going to hide their stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, I remember the last thing I remember is hiding my daughter's iPad. Going, this is such a good hiding spot. I'm never going to remember. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember where it is. Oh, man. So, I still. I've got no idea where oh. I hit it. <laughs> they say it's as addicting as crack. Yeah, yeah like yeah. Well, wanting to go on your phone, wanting yeah. to be logged in. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm more concerned about the habit. Like it's just a. So they won't talk. Yeah, it's just a habit to grab it. Mm-hmm become mm. engrossed in this screen. It is a battle. I can't believe mm -hmm. how hard it is to get your kids to do yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter who they're putting their photos up for. It could be anybody that sees them, anybody that says that they know them. There's a lot of cyberbullying. Um, they say things over the screen that they wouldn't normally say to each other. Even, you know, some of the clothes that people are wearing that are posting, they wouldn't go oh, outside yeah, wearing that, but they're quite happy to post those kind of photos. You know, yeah. for the entire world to see, you know, what's what's the difference there. And they're really into getting likes, have you noticed? Mm -hmm. Like popularity. Yeah. Yeah. And that's why, isn't that why yeah. they post those semi naked yeah, definitely. pictures? Definitely. We've just moved to an area that's, you know, got a little bit more room. They've got motorbikes to ride and, you know, it's still difficult to take their phones off them and kick them away from the television and, and tell them to go outside and play. Like, I know with my eldest especially, she's, you know, she's right into being able to discuss anything and everything with, you know, their friends online. But, um, you know, uh, she did add a friend and um, I said, do you know this person? Oh, yeah, it's a friend of a friend. Have you met this person? No. Delete. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, hell no. I've got one in high school now and they mm -hmm. seem to have a lot of talks on those. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. would you let a stranger in your room? Well, yeah. this device is letting a stranger... Yeah, absolutely. Your I totally house. agree with that. Like I was so naive to it, yeah. I didn't even know anything about it. So it was easy to just bury my head in the sand yeah. until you start talking to other mums and oh, this can happen and that can happen. So I actually turned around and asked my kids, can you show me what you do on here, please? Mm -hmm. yeah. And they are amazing at how clear they are with these things. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. So we sat down actually as a family and said, what's fair? What do you guys think's fair? And what oh, do really? we think's fair? Yeah. They want to be able to have what they call free time. Mm -hmm. um, you know, as soon as they get up in the morning, they want to be able to check their things. So we're like, well, no, because if you do that, it'll just go right through to school time mm -hmm. and all your jobs won't get done. Yeah. So we actually turn the Wi-Fi off at night now <laughs> and it doesn't get turned on until they finish their jobs in the morning. You know, um, when you're cranky with someone, you know, years ago and you got on the, like, got off the phone, you hung it up, yeah. the power you feel when you yeah, turn right? that Wi-Fi off. <laughs> and then, like, you just, you can stand there and count back from three, two, one, doors open, and they emerge. Really? Mm -hmm. When it comes to technology, in particular internet, I'm 
not joking around when it comes to rules. I don't like having um, any of the electrical equipment in their bedroom, so no phones, no laptops, nothing in their bedroom. Um, so at night time, before they go to bed, um, everything needs to go. And we've got like a charge station where everything charges, so everything goes onto that. It seems like I've got no control over my kids, but I reckon I've got to get a locked. Do you have a lock Safe? device? Yeah, for, for the... <laughs> We're organising one for our chocolate, not the <laughs> <laughs> I think what we've decided is we can't really bury our heads in the sand and it's good to talk with each other and work out yes. you know, what's yeah, normal and what's yeah. not normal and yeah, make some true. ground rules and, and stick with that. Yeah, yeah. 100%. Definitely. Yeah, absolutely. It's too dangerous not to. Mm -hmm.